Good morning from Seymour in Victoria. I do apologise for the throaty, congested voice. I have just given myself a treatment with the old sinus rinse and uh, that'll clear up in a little while. I have had bad bronchial problems for the last couple of months and it's been a really, really, really unwelcome return to what I used to be back in the days of being a wage slave and sitting in air-conditioned offices and on air-conditioned buses and such and such, getting out of bed, walking down to the bus stop when it's still minus seven degrees, then getting into a warm bus and out again and into an air-conditioned office. It, It really did play havoc with my bronchial tubes. And I was over that for many, many years, especially when I was up in Darwin, quite con... Well, what's the word I'm looking for? Counterpoint? No. Um, uh, I can't even think English. Yeah, you'd think that up in the tropics, with all that humidity, that, that it'd make it worse. But really, it was just a continuation of being on the road with house sitting for five years, non-stop. I would typically get one, maybe two colds or whatever flus a year. This was in the days of pre-COVID and then once COVID started, <clears throat> touch wood. Well, somebody came up with a phrase, oh, I know, the woman in the passage, which is a clothing store in the main street of Port Ferry in Bank Street. We were having a chat about this, that and the other and I said, oh yeah, I haven't had COVID. And she said, I haven't tested positive for COVID. And I went, yeah, I'm going to go with that myself, to be quite honest. Because during the time of, let's say, March 2020 to now, I've had some fierce and fierce and bad colds. And yes, I've done tests and what have you. But, you know, if you don't test every couple of days, and some people have to, then whether you can say that you've not had it or not is another matter. But anyway, here we are. This is Seymour. Uh, I wanted to leave by 9 o'clock, which meant that I set myself a target of 8am to leave. It's currently 8.47am, so why am I still talking with you? I want to get on the road and be up to Dixon by about 3pm, which means 4pm. I'll see if I'm looking at you. I'm about to jump in the hippie camper and head up at a sedate pace and grab some breakfast on the way. Bye for now.